watch. Buenos dias! Did you sleep well? Good morning, Mr. Cooper. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. It is August 19th, 2023. Welcome to CBS Saturday Morning. Historic storm warning. An extremely rare and powerful hurricane puts much of the west coast and southwest in the crosshairs. We'll have the forecast on this once in a generation storm. Rising death toll. On Maui, more victims are discovered in the devastation, with more than a thousand still unaccounted for. We'll have details on new federal aid and what some are calling missed warning signs. Death in captivity. A famed orca who performed in an aquarium more than 50 years dies suddenly just as plans were being made to return her to the wild. And real life retold. Director Peter Berg has made hit films out of true stories like Lone Survivor, Deepwater Horizon, and Patriot's Day. Now he's turning his attention to our nation's opioid crisis. We'll talk with him and his new Netflix series, Painkiller. But first, we begin this morning with a look at today's eye-opener. Your world in 90 seconds. Anyone can do it. Even me? Sure, even me. All you need is long hair, makeup, and tight pants. And we can get that stuff right here in your mom's closet. Yeah, sure. That's right, Billy. Yeah. See, he saw the picture of you on the computer and that you was going blah when you were playing basketball. And, and who else in the world does that? Her name is Mr. Big Baby Paco Derm. I want it. But she likes me best. Besides, I already got teeth. Uh... Go downstairs. But I must finish my juice box. <sighs> Gracias. <laughs> hmm, nice. Oh my goodness, you are so cute. I think I will call you Juan and you Juanita. Yeah, I, I, I really um, thought that the finale was awesome. No, I got everything I needed out of that hug. Way to go, Eduardo! You captured the cannibal ghost! And it was the most delicious badger ever. That was amazing! Good job, Agents Puppy and Catswell! You've done tough proud! This is nice! Everyone's being super helpful today. My name isn't really Francisco, it's Francesca. My mom wanted a girl. I found some moves! My thirst isn't on the loose anymore. I just want to thank you all for your help. Mount Bear River is flowing again. The other storm drains are painted too. And the whole Mount Bear watershed too. I was just going to say that. Yes, I saved the forest. You're our hero. I am feeling like me again. Exactly. You kings and queens of Woodland Valley. Oh, Lala, I am so excited. I just know that this time I am going to get camp store. I think I just found what I was looking for. Try taking a dip in Big Springs, little bee. I'm sure the fish there will get you clean. If you ask me, I think Bunga smells fine, just the way he is. Yeah. And in Bunga's case, he's a stinky little honey badger. Thanks, Uncle Timon. Pretty. Glad to be almost alive. Really? Gracias. This morning's eye opener is presented by Progressive, making it easy to bundle insurance. Oh, yeah. See? Fuck off. Totally. Hmm. How do you guys call your husbands? I just give them away. You don't want to hear it's what I call them. Yeah, to look. What do you call it? We don't want to know. We don't want to know. Big yeah. Daddy. Oh! <laughs> Big Daddy! Oh, that's crazy! I Marshall can't believe you do it! Right on in, everybody. Let's just deep dive. There you go. Welcome to the weekend, everyone. I'm Michelle Miller. My name is Eduardo. Along with Dana Jacobson and Jeff Floor there. And this morning, we're going to take you off the coast of Florida for an ocean adventure. It's, that's where a program is transforming the lives of young people by taking them off the streets and onto the water, teaching them a love of fishing and the sea. Then it's off to California and the massive studio of an acclaimed artist who has worked with Oprah, Bono, and other big names. Glenn Kino uses every medium of expression to create powerful works based on his activism. Now he's put the focus on his own family and the historic injustice they endured using virtual reality to recreate a lost world. 
Plus, with gambling, gangsters, and time in prison, it may sound like a Martin Scorsese film, but it is all in the true life story of Billy Walters, one of the most successful sports bettors of all time. We'll talk to him about his truly fascinating new memoir just released. Then you might call it a life-changing cake. That's because when her co-workers got a taste of it, it started her on a whole new career. Now Jocelyn Delk Adams is a popular YouTube cooking instructor and is just out with her second book. We're gonna meet her out on the dish. Are you guys hungry? Yeah! Yeah! Yes! 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 Yeah! Yes! Yeah! Delicious carrot cake. It was so delicious, I ate the whole thing. Almost. <laughs> now it's gone. And talk about honors, singer-songwriter Rhiannon Giddens had already won two Grammy Awards and a MacArthur Genius Grant. Mm. Then in May, she was awarded the Pulitzer Prize for co-writing an opera. Mm. Just yesterday, Giddens released her first album of all original songs. She will perform for us in our Saturday session. I promise you, it is a special one. That and so much more is all ahead. Oh yeah, for sure. Me too. But we begin with this morning's top story. An extremely rare, powerful storm threatening the West Coast. More than 40 million people are bracing for Hurricane Hillary, which could become the first tropical storm to make landfall in California since 1939. The Category 4 storm is churning off Mexico's Pacific coast, packing winds of 130 miles per hour. Right now, it's 270 miles southwest of Baja, California.